Russian EVA-49 will be conducted by Oleg Novinsky as EV-1 in the red striped suit and Pyotr Dubrov as EV-2 in the blue striped suit. EV-2 will egress the Mini Research Module 2 or MRM-2 first, and EV-1 will hand out the power cable clamps and bridge rail handrail bundle. Then EV-1 will egress MRM-2. Then EV-1 will translate to the Strela operator post and EV2 will translate to the Strela end effector and stow the hardware bundle and release the Strela end effector. EV1 will extend the boom of Strela with EV2 on Strela to the service module. EV2 will tether Strela end effector to the service module just above the multi-purpose laboratory module or MLM. EV1 will translate to the connector patch panel number two on MRM2. Pyotr will install cable clamps from the bundle that the two brought out. Oleg will then route the MLM USOS Power Cable Bundle 2 to the MLM installing the cable into the cable clamps Piotr installed. Oleg will then translate back to MRM2 connector patch panel number 1 and release it from MRM2. Piotr will mate the four connectors of MLM USOS Power Cable Bundle 2 to the MLM patch panel number 16. Oleg will route MLM USOS power cable bundle number one to the MLM, installing the cable into the cable clamps Piotr had installed. Then Oleg will translate back up to the Strela operator post. Piotr will mate the four connectors of the MLM USOS power cable bundle number one to MLM patch panel number 15. Piotr will translate back to the Strela end effector and release the tether. Oleg will then maneuver Strela with Piotr attached to it and extend it to the PMA and FGB interface. Piotr will install the Strela cradle on the FGB. Oleg then translates down Strela's boom to meet up with Piotr. The two will demate the service module power cable and incorporate it with the new MLM power cable bundle number two into the US power system. Then, the MLM Ethernet cable will be mated while the teams on the ground power up MLM cable bundle number two and the power down of the next power cable. The two will then demate the service module power cable and incorporate it with the new MLM power cable bundle number one into the US power system. Once all the connections have been made, Oleg will translate back to the Strela operator post. Piotr will release the Strela boom from the cradle. Oleg will then maneuver the Strela boom and Piotr to the SM and Piotr will tether the Strela end effector to the SM handrail. Piotr will then release the bridge rail handrail bundles from Strela and attach the bridge handrails to the MLM. Oleg will release the MLM USOS Ethernet cable and reel from MRM2 
and route the cable to the MLM patch panel number 17. will leave the reel on the Strela end effector. Oleg will then mate the MLM USOS Ethernet cable. Oleg will then translate back to the Strela operator post and Piotr will translate to the Strela end effector and will release the Strela end effector from the service module handrail. Oleg will then maneuver the Strela boom to the MRM2 where Piotr will attach the tether to the end effector and MRM2 handrail. Then Oleg will translate to the magnetic attachment location on MRM2 and Piotr will remove the hardware from the end effector and stow it into MRM2 and retrieve the bio-risk experiment. Piotr will translate to the magnetic attachment location and attach the bio-risk experiment. The crew will then translate back to the MRM2 EVA hatch. EV1 will egress first followed by EV2 and close the EVA hatch. This will conclude Russian EVA 49.